How to Sell Digital Products on Redbubble. So hi guys, in today's video, I will be giving you a tutorial step-by-step -step on how to create your Redbubble account and also how to sell your digital products in this platform. Basically, Redbubble is an online marketplace where you can sell your creative designs and artwork on various products such as stickers, t-shirts, phone cases, and more. So in this guide, we will be focusing on how to sell digital products in Redbubble, which includes products such as printable wall art, digital stickers, and digital downloads. So when you open your browser, simply go to redbubble.com and basically you will be routed to the login page right here. Once you can see the login page here under login, you can actually see a bolded sign up um, word right there simply click on that one so let's create our red bubble account now okay now once we've clicked on our sign up um link or button the next thing that we're going to do is to input or simply select whether you're going to have the artist sign up or the customer sign up so of course since we want to sell our products we are going to choose the artist sign up but if you want to buy products from redbubble please choose or select customer sign up okay. now let's go to our next process so simply input your email address your shop name and your password let me just input all the necessary information right here. And there you have it. So once done, you can actually tick on the box if you want to receive special offers and um, artist news. But as for me, I'm going to leave it as is and I won't tick the box. All right, so let's continue and let's sign up. Now, the next thing that we're going to be routed at is our Redbubble dashboard. So here, you will be welcomed by Redbubble. And you can actually complete the steps by following on these um, simple and easy steps. So first, we are going to create products, upload your original art, and choose products and add at least five designs to get your shop ready for customers. So you can actually click on Add Design right here. All right. So the next uh, step that we're going to do is to set up our shop. So in setting up our shop, customize your shop to stand out. Customers love supporting original artists. Th tell them your story and share your social links. So in this section or in this process, you're going to need to add a profile picture, add a cover image, add your social links, add a bio as well. So it would be best in order for you to connect your also other online platforms to your Redbubble account. Now, the next step is to get paid. Of course, this is the step that we would like to get to know better. So here, you just need to verify your details so you can start selling. So you need to add your name and address, confirm your email, confirm your mobile phone number, add your payment details. And then you would be able to successfully um, sell your products on Redbubble. Now, if you scroll down below, there are actually tips for new sellers that you can check on. So first is you can review your product pricing. So you can check on this article. Advertise your products in off-site marketing. Of course, we don't want to only fo focus on Redbubble, but we also want to connect our Redbubble to our social media links like Instagram, Facebook, to also make our... Um, coverage wider next is the art of tagging on redbubble so it's like using the hashtags but in a different way i'll be showing it to you later on next is designing with products in mind and uploader 101 so here you can actually see the help center if you want to know the uploader 101 and also help with payment setup um, the help center will actually answer all your questions with regards to that one now the next thing that we're going to do is we are going to upload our first work so we're going to click on this button right here in the upper right hand corner add new work click on it 
and then basically it will route us to this page now there are actually two, op two options that you can do first is upload new work and copy an existing work so i'm going to do is um, for the file requirement for this one by the way we recommend high resolution jp jpeg png or gif files with minimum of 1000 px resolution for more help check out our design guide so you can click on that link and therefore uh, the next option we can actually have copy an existing work as well uh, you can copy the same products and design placement for um, another design this is particularly great for color variants basically all right so what i'm going to choose right here is i'm going to upload a new work since i am just still beginning my red bubble journey so let's click on upload new work right here all right once you've clicked on upload new work it will route you to your file section or ask you to input or place the file that you would want to uh, download on your redbubble account so let me just look for the um digital art that i have made okay here so as you can see the next section here in your added work you can actually put english dutch french and espanol you can choose whichever and then for the english here i am going to input my title this is a required field by the way so let me just put mock-up frame Congratulations, new graduate. Okay. All right. So the next thing that we have right here is our tags. So in the tags, actually, tags are how your audience finds your work. Use 15 re relevant tags per upload. Use search terms your audience would look to uh, find your work, including your name. Make sure to separate tags with commas. Example, panda, bear, black, and white, something like that. So basically, it's like when we input the caption on Instagram, it's like your hashtag, but we are just going to simply separate it with our commas right here. And we don't need to put hashtags. All right, now let me just input all the necessary information I need to put in my tag section right here. And I'll just have three tags. Now, the next thing that you're going to have is the description. So share the story or meaning behind your work. You don't have to give away any secrets, but your audience will appreciate a little insight into what you have created. So here, it will just give you um, a description and how you created the work and like the story basically of, of the work itself. So that's about it. Now, you can actually also choose the background color right here. So for example, we're going to click on the background color and then um, simply drag to your desired color and then it will actually change the background color. We will see that in a while if we scroll down to the product section or the products that Redbubble offers. Okay, there you have it. Now. If we scroll down, we can actually see um, the products that have the design, right? So as you can see, there's the background color has already changed in the phone case section and there. All right. So for say, for instance, we're going to make use or we're going to create um, something you can actually sell a lot of products here in Redbubble, but I'm going to focus on artboard. Uh, let me see first. Okay, so as you can see, there are even backpacks, socks, apparels, all that you can sell. Now here below, we can actually add the media. So I'm going to check on photography and digital art as well as well as design and illustration okay so i'm gonna focus on those two i'm gonna untick the photography section right here now you can also default products in your shop okay so you can actually also opt to let everybody see your work or only for you and um answer these two questions if this is a mature content or not and there you have it tick the box if you have everything you need
Now let's go back to our dashboard. So just follow the next step like you need to set up your shop and get paid and then you will be able to um, finally sell your digital products on Redbubble. Not only your digital products but again this platform is very helpful for um, digital artists not only for digital artists but for artists themselves who would like to make use of this e-commerce platform so that's about it for today's video guys hope you find this helpful and thank you so much for watching